bless the name of the Lord Jesus Christ this morning. Greetings to you this morning in no other name, but in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior this morning. I just want to encourage somebody, you know, I just want to speak these words. I just want to release these words this morning. Glory be to God. I am not going to be selfish this morning. I'm not going to keep this word this morning, but I will release this word. And I just want to say to somebody right there in your pain, right there in your struggle, right there in your frustration. Don't you dare turn back. Don't you dare give up. Don't you dare lose hope this morning, but believe in the God, which is the author and finisher of your faith this morning. Know that things are still going to work together for your good this morning. Hallelujah to God. There is this song this morning that is on my heart. You know, I was just going through and I just started to sing this chorus. And as I was singing this chorus, I saw, glory be to God, how, the Lord. So as I was saying, I was going through and I saw this song and I just, I started to sing this song. And believe you me, it, it brought me so much encouragement this morning. And it, it, it let this song serve as a reminder to you that you are not forsaken. That even though you're going through, you're going through, you're not forsaken this morning. That even though you have a little tears this morning, you are still not forsaken. Even though you are faced with sickness this morning, you are still not forsaken this morning. I belong to the King. I'm a child of His love. And He never forsaken His own. He will call me someday to his place above. I will dwell in his glory if I throne. I'm a child of the king. I am made of his love. And he never forsaken his own. He will call me someday to his place above. I will dwell in his glorified throne. I belong to the king. I'm a child of his love. And he never forsaken his own. He will call me someday through his place above. I will dwell in his glorified throne. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. If you can just hold on to those words this morning. You are a child of a king. You are made of his love. And he will never forsake his home his own but he will call you someday to his place above and he will dwell in his glorified throne and this is why i started and say that it doesn't matter what you're facing what you have to go through what is before you today if we can keep this mind that glory be to god one day we will be called to his place above glory be to god that there he is not a man that he should lie but the Bible said that he has gone to prepare a place for us. Glory be to God. And we must believe that there will be a reward. We must believe that if we continue in Christ and for Christ, there is going to be an end reward. Glory be to God. There is going to be an end reward for us, for you, for me this morning, beloved. Glory be to God. And so we have to push. We have to push. We have to not give up. We have to we have to continue. We have to not turn back. Glory be to God. Because he who promise is faithful. Glory be to God. He's not a man that he should ever lie to us. Glory be to God. Psalms 3 says, Lord, how are they increased that troubled me? Many are they that rise up against me. Many there be which say of my soul, there is no 
help for him in God. Glory be to God. We are persecuted. We are lied on. We feel uncomfortable. We feel like there's no hope. We feel like not only are we suffering, not only are we, not only are we going through the this, this season, but there are those who are laughing. There are those who are making assumptions. There are those who are casting judgment. There are those who are thinking that God has forsaken you, that God is not going to redeem you, that there's not going to be a turnaround for you. But glory be to God. Hold on to these things this morning. Glory be to God. Hold on to these things this morning. Even David was at that place when he had to say, How long shall they increase that troubled me? How long shall the situation arise? How long shall this trouble last in my life? How long will this night last? How long will the storm last? Glory be to God. I am in the storm. I may have my faith, yes. I have not completely lose hope. But I'm in this distress. I'm in this trouble. I'm in this season where I'm not on top. I'm in this season where I'm just I'm just going. I'm just I'm just surviving on the daily provision. But glory be to God, you are surviving. You are alive. Glory be to God. But there are some that are looking, that are saying, where is your help? Who is going to be your help? Who is going to be your shield? Who is going to be your defense this morning? But verse 3 says, but thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and the lifter up of my head. I cried unto the Lord with my voice, and he heard me out of his holy temple. Glory be to God. I lay me down and slept. I awake, for the Lord sustains me. I will not be afraid of ten thousand of people that have set themselves against me round about. Because God, my God, this is what is coming. Arise, O Lord. Save me, O oh my God, for thou hast smitten all mine enemies on the cheekbone. Thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly. Salvation belongeth unto the Lord. Salvation belongeth unto the Lord this morning. And his blessing will be upon his people. Glory be to God. His blessing will be upon his people. Are you counted as a people of God? Are you counted as a daughter and as a man of a man of God? Because the blessing of God will surely be upon you. The salvation of the Lord is his ability to deliver. Is his ability to, to create a way when there is no way. The salvation of the Lord is the ability to redeem you from whatever situation and circumstance that you are facing right now. So in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I pray this morning that this will be a blessing to you. Glory be to God. At this is to me. As this is to me this morning. I'm a child of the king. I am made of his love. You are a child of the king. You are made of his love this morning. You belong to the king. You are made of his love. And he never forsakes. Get his own. He will call you one day to his place above. And there you will abide in his glorified throne. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Continue in Christ today. Continue in the Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen.